Hey, Steve Basic Architect. We're out here at our historic rental project. And as you can see, we just got insulation. So if you remember from some of the video shorts, we had to shore up this whole ceiling. Um, this is the original house that we're in. So in here, we have uh, three inches of closed cell with a remaining about five inches of open cell there. So it's going to get us 20, you know, probably like R40 ish or so. But, uh, you know, this is inside that historic commission. And then we bump it up a little higher once we get above the uh, inside of the room and into that vaulted space in the attic. On the walls here, we have a. Uh, Rockwell bat, and you can see here, pull this one away, here we did a what's termed a flashing bat. So we have one inch of closed cell that gets sprayed in the cavity, and then we get a friction fit bat that then fills that up. So the uh, closed cell there will take care of, you know, a bunch of air leakage. It's not the best air barrier, but it is a good one. Um, if we come down here, make our way into the owner's suite. You can see here on all the new construction, we moved to a five and a half inch dense pack cellulose wall system, which is one of my favorites. And we like to do that when we can. But also notice all of our header pockets. You remember in the framing videos, we had our header pockets up there. So you can see those are all fully insulated. And then the cavities there, those are the cheek walls for the dormer. And then we have one of our cellulose there. So, all right, so that's our uh, insulation walk. Steve Basic Architect out here at our historic rental.